morning people this is Sam South Carolina happy bees on uh Jan let me get this thing straight on January straight enough on January the 25th Monday very cloudy today but the temperature is, is pretty nice it's in the 50s bees are flying and we're going to take a look at this one over by the south fence. Move this here. Keeps things from warping up. You can tell this one already warped. That's why it's not on there. But this is a, a queen that I bought last, last, last. Hmm. Last year, they're overwintering good, I hope. And this is one that we're planning on making some um, some some nukes. We ain't hoping nothing. We're gonna make some nukes off of this one. They have just about eaten all their food. I think this queen's called a sassafras or something like this. Sass or something another. But I think they'll make some pretty good queen. Now y'all know that once they go out and, and mate, they come back, they're not purebred. They're mated with some of the best bees in South Carolina, which is mine. They're hopkinized bees, which means they're just a mixed breed. But they do good. We've got wire on this thing so it's easy to come up. There's a lot of heat coming out of there. So we pick this up. You can see how much food they've eaten. They will need more. And it's a pretty good amount of bees in there. See if y'all can see that, yeah. Slide them all in one way. Okay, with this one we have honey. Not much on that side. But here we have honey. No brood. Has some honey, has some nectar. We put it over here and lean it up against the hive. Give me girls. Take the beetle trap out. There are two beetles on the outside of it. As far as their honey, they didn't eat her pollen patty. Okay. 
this one has honey and nectar I mean honey and pollen on it no bees Besides, same thing we have honey here has some nectar mixed in there this over here is pollen and I think we may clean out the bottom they've been doing a good job but you know this one has brood Look for the queen. See, no queen. We have brood in here, caps brood. We have some larvae in there too, which means they're probably eggs. This is honey. This is nectar. This side here, same thing. So, if we don't see the queen, we know she's in here. There she is. Okay, this one here has some eggs, some brood, and larvae. And when it warms up, we'll turn that frame around so they'll build out the other side. This one we have honey, pollen, this is all pollen over here which is a good thing. Last thing, we're going to push all these back. And I don't guess we'll change the bottom. Put these little girls back in the house. Let's see here with something with beetle eggs. Nope. Sometimes when you put the traps down or these things down, the beetles will start laying eggs in here because the bees can't get to them. We're going to put this one back in. This is all honey. We're going to put the honey towards the, the babies. Won't be long before we're putting these in a bigger box or adding a box. Okay, let's take this off. Take all this paper off.
We're going to use a staple gun on this. This is just this crooked. We're going to put a little staple here. Maybe. Got that one. Put a staple there. Kind of hold it straighter. Take the paper here. Put it right there. We're gonna spray a little water on it. Other than that, they have to wait a couple of days before the moisture gets in the hive and they can get up. I don't always do this. I'm back here trying to separate my Paper towels. Take our sugar and sprinkle it on that wet paper towel and it can start getting the moisture. pounds in here. I'll give them some insulation, moisture barrier, and all that good stuff. Well that's them. And we'll take this put it in my bucket over here. Make sure there ain't no bees mixed up in it. I use my torch to clean things. See, all pretty. Put this one back on. Why are you doing that thing? Because.
that there, that there, that there, that there, and that way I can run better. Okay, I don't use 3 8 anymore, y'all, to build my tops. I use uh, Vantex. I was finally able to find it. And pollen trap. Pollen bees. There it is.